So Saturday morning quick update. Here is the classic two. Here is a precariously placed blue scuzzy. Here is the Apple CD 150. So if we put the caddy in. There we go, it's got CD ROM support now. So one of the benefits of using a blue SCSI is um, I can use these disk images in an emulator, but unfortunately they've got the wrong extension, so apps like Basilisk won't uh, won't see it. So you just rename it to DSK, start up Basilisk, and there's my disk image. So this is a 500 meg disk image, which is overkill for the classic two but yeah it works quite nicely so so once you've finished fiddling you just have to make sure that you rename it to HDA and then pop that disc in the blue scuzzy so here's the micro SD card So I use Mini VMAC to create the disk image. Only when I put it into the Mac Classic, it wanted to format the drive. So I found that um, if I put it into Basilisk, then, uh, then it would behave. So if we open up here, you'll see the same folder structure as it was on the Mac in Basilisk. So I'm quite pleased.